All right, we're talking about weather and flooding this time. Uh, flooding in the Pittsburgh area. We want to show you uh, some video. Yeah, this is video uh, from uh, yesterday, I believe, uh, because over the course of several days, there was a lot of rain that came down to the Pittsburgh area, and we know um, that one person actually had to be rescued. A scary situation to say the least. Water rising just so rapidly there. Uh, they can keep the flooding in Pittsburgh. Yikes. Mercifully, we avoided that when we had all that snow melt there and there were concerns over flooding. There we are. We're talking right now about the Warren Community Foundation. This is uh, the time of the year where they are accepting applications for scholarships. And they have a lot of scholarships they are giving away. This community foundation actually has about 40 of them that they offer. And they say that anybody, uh, who, a student who is maybe going through a, a four year degree program, even a vocational school can apply online with just one single application. Nice and easy there, and they're trying to get the word out because they do have so many. And then we head to Belgium, where uh, farmers are upset to say the least. This is the beginning of their protest. They actually then headed out, hit the roads, and blocked off access to seaports there. They're upset about uh, the European Union's agricultural laws and practices. They say they're hurting badly as a result, and so that blockade of the North Sea trying to send a message to lawmakers in Belgium. Obviously, people frustrated, to say the least. Absolutely. Lots more to get to on 